Mm, so far I didn't have an accident yet. Oh, there's the dog. Hello, welcome. Today I'm playing Early Card, as you could see. It's to this day still one of my favorite games, actually. It's just a fun little game to play sometime in between. Um, some facts I wanted to tell you. It has been developed in 1983 for Atari. So there's an Atari version that actually has is more colors. And there's an IBM version that was released in 1984. I only played the IBM version. Today I'm playing in DOSBox because that makes it so easy to play old games. And Alicat was actually initially developed by John Harris as a one screen prototype, um, but he kind of got stuck with it and he passed it on to Bill Williams who made it into the game we know today. The controls are pretty easy, you just use the arrow keys and then I use the Alt key for um, the alt key for special actions as it says here. So you're a cat. I actually learned the cat is supposedly called Freddy. I don't know where you would know that from. Maybe it was on the box. And you need to get up and into the into the rooms here. Um, yeah, jumping is just with the arrow keys. It's really easy controls. And now I beat that level and now my job is it to go into a room again. And here I want to go up and meet my love interest. And her name supposedly is Felicita. Or Felicia, Felicia. <laughs> Felicita. <laughs> Oh, that's a song. <laughs> that's not the girl's name. Um, yeah, so it's a pretty cool game. Um, so far I didn't have an accident yet. Oh, there's the dog. He wants to eat me. Um, yeah, so in a room you will want to put some dirt down so that the broom is busy. Otherwise he will go and kick you around. And here it's best to wait for the spider to... Why did he jump there now? For the spider to come down a bit. Um, if I'm sitting down here, the dog's also coming, wanting to eat me. And that can happen. <laughs> Evil cats. Uh, it's pretty dangerous. Um, oh no. Yeah. Um, it's not so easy to play and explain at the same time, either way. Um, oh, same room again. There's quite a few different... Well, that was all my lies, but we can just start again. Um, there's a few different rooms and they are... Um, they're a bit different on how hard they are to do. Some rooms you maybe don't really want to do at all. Uh, the cheese room is one of the easiest, but later when you get a bit higher, I've completed the levels a few times. The cheese room can be very hard as well because the mice just get so quickly. Um, yeah. Oh. Yeah, in the beginning you still get lots of um, clothes on the pa on the line. Here you get a pretty easy to try to get up. So the higher the level, the the harder it gets. You get you get less barrels at the bottom to jump up to. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, so. The barrels become more sparse, more trash falling out of the window. Why do I keep getting up in this room? Well, at least that was pretty quick. 
And here's actually the only spot where you can have a rest. But of course only if you've already completed the first the first part of the game basically. Uh, because now the mice are not throwing trash and I can just sit here and have a bit of a brief. So let's see if we can get to Felicia once again. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, I would have liked to show you what happens when you go to a two times. A, why is there always a dog here? Two times in a row. Oh, you can also leave through the window again, either by choice or by accident. And the broom often throws you out, which can be very annoying. Huh. Here you can also leave the, the, the parcel with the alt key so that that enemy cat basically disappears. And now watch what happens. Well, and now you can see there's a lot less possibilities already for me to get up on. And that's basically the game, now you've seen it and I highly recommend playing it because it's fun. <laughs> Goodbye.